Hello farmers, welcome back to another episode of Surviving Elk Mountain. I am the Northern Gamer and it's been a while, <laughs> I'll be honest, it's been a while again. Um, life just generally got in the way, I started a brand new job and things got in the way. So uh, hopefully I'm going to try and bulk do episodes from now on. plan is to do three or four episodes and get these scheduled to come out over the next few weeks. But anyway, whilst we're here, I've got some plans. I'd quite like to get into mowing grass. We've got loads and loads of grass around. In fact, I'll show you that in a bit. But let's just have a look at some of the equipment that we might have available to us. And this is what I'm thinking about going for. It's John Deere. It's the 2280. It's a mower. It has a header on and all sorts of cool attachments. Uh, yeah, this is what I'm thinking about going for. I think this will do us lots and lots of good in terms of actually mowing grass and then this is the header that goes with it so we're looking at about 19,000 ish for the mower and the header and then I found these so these are a tedder and a windrower and they are fairly inexpensive so about 1300 each so these could be very very useful as we have a very very limited balance they've got a good working width and yeah, I reckon these are what we're aiming for. So I've just finished off with some wood here. I actually want to show you something. I've got this tool that might just show you the scope of the land that we've got. Just hang on a second, let's just get it loaded up. Here we go. It's a drone. <laughs> so let's go and have a look at some of the land that we've got because this is actually a massive plot I can't quite work out how far up it goes but yep all this is ours so that could be a nice big patch of grass that we could cut and then turn it into a field if we come up to the top of this field now the land actually goes all the way up to the ridge or certainly the bottom of the ridge there which is good so we've got all these trees here Apparently somewhere there, over here there's a stone, which is like the marker. Come through here through these trees, try not to crash. Ah, there it is. Right, so that is the marker. It's the top left-hand corner, and that goes all the way down to the road. And then this across here, I believe it's those boulders there, are kind of like the marker. As we come past our little house there, we follow this ridge round. This is all ours. Again, that boulder is the marker point, so that one there. And then it follows the ridge round, and there's another boulder there, so we're going in the right direction. And over that ridge, and all the way down to the road, up to the main road, and then all this is ours to work. We really have a lot of land that we could do basically anything with. I mean, all this is still ours, so we could maybe put some sort of production buildings down here, maybe some livestock. Um, the hills could be a little bit awkward for um, for doing any sort of field work. But we could plant more trees. That could be good. We could have like a designated woodland area. Pretty much. All, we could do anything here. We've got so much scope. And then back up to this other junction. And then left. And again, all this land is ours. There's a couple of rocks and stuff down there. They probably won't be much of a problem though. But I mean, some nice big areas that we could stick some good fields in. Lots of wood and trees we could be cutting down. <laughs> Obviously, I might do those in uh, in the background, <laughs> so you don't have to sit and watch another episode of me cutting trees down. But I mean, look at all that nice big flat land. I'll just head back to uh, the car here, get this thing, because I think we've got enough footage there. But yeah, so I think what we need to do first is chop down some more trees and get those sold. Makes enough money to go and buy a mower. And then this is going to be our first sort of project, this strip here. Get this mode, get it maybe tedded, uh, windrowed, collected, and sold. And that'll be our first non wood <laughs> bit of activity, which will be good. And yeah, so I think that's the plan. So we'll get this brought back and bring it back down. Oh, steady, not to crush it. So behind the scenes, whilst you've been watching that footage, I've been cutting down and selling trees. Uh, we're almost there. Hopefully, this last load should just take us. Uh, to the number we need to be at, which is about 19,000. So let's have a look. We're at 15 so far. Get this sold. And that's given us more than enough. There we go. So let's go and get this bought. So this is the mower. 
don't think we're going to do anything else. 14 grand's about right for it. Let's have a look. Do we need a weight at this stage? It just looks like a tractor backwards, doesn't it? I think that's basically what they've done here. Right, let's get this purchased. Nice. Let's get the header. Nice, let's go get it. So I'll bring the truck down, but I'll have to leave this here. Look at this beauty. <laughs> right, let's get him. Looks nice from the cab, though. So let's get this picked up. Uh, there we go, get that attached. Right, let's head back. Okay, so once we get back, uh, I think we'll probably just get cracking, I guess. little strip at the top and then I think I'll go and buy the tether and yeah I think I'll get the tether and the wind rower I think we've just got enough money left uh, get all this turned over get it wind road and then probably we'll have to look at some sort of way of picking it up um, I don't think I'm gonna be able to afford a bailer anytime soon probably the, well the, the easiest option would just be a, a sort of front loader with a bucket on and scoop it up um, I wonder if there's like a trailer or something I might have to go I have to go into town and see if anyone's got anything I can borrow I'm sure one of our neighbours has got something um, but yeah that's pr I think that's the last of the grass cut so let's go get this set up and go and buy the rest of the equipment we need so I've purchased the windrower and the tether here we are so I'm going to leave this trailer over here, I'll leave it somewhere a bit tidier. Uh, get these taken back and get using them. probably a good time to end the episode in the next episode we'll try and find a way of collecting all this up and getting it sold but for now don't forget if you've liked this episode give it a like down below 
and all the usual stuff. Give us a subscribe, share us around, and I think it's time for a cuppa. Yeah.